Ahead of the demolition of Noida's Supertech Twin Towers this Sunday, there is anxiety among residents of the apartments that are located near the demolition site. They'll have to vacate their homes on the day of the demolition. And the demolition itself is going to take just nine seconds in a controlled blast. But the residents will be kept out of their homes for nine hours. Multi-story high, the infamous Twin Towers in Noida's Sector 93A, taller than Delhi's Qutub Minar. But in another four days, these will come down because they have been deemed unsafe. 7,000 residents who live barely 10 meters away in Supertech Emerald will have to vacate their homes by 7 a.m. on the 28th of August and stay out till 4 p.m. 52-year-old Rajendra Raj Singh is making arrangements to protect his belongings from flying debris. He and his wife are also shifting things out of the flat. There is anxiety among most residents. The demolition will be carried out by Edifice Engineering. 3500 kg of explosives have been placed near the pillars to ensure the rubble and dust doesn't move outwards. The water pole implosion technology that we have told you before, the same technology is going to conduct here. So it is basically, it is a one floor heat to other floor. So basement one se chalu hoga, fall girna. Ground wala basement one pe jayega, first floor ground pe jayega, second floor first pe jayega. This is called the waterfall effect. Special arrangements are being done for the demolition day. Noida and the Greater Noida Expressway to remain shut from 2.15 to 2.45 p.m. Areas in 400 meter radius of the Twin Towers to remain sealed. No fly zone in Noida from 2.15 to 2.45 p.m. Special arrangements are also being made at hospitals in Noida to deal with emergencies. There are going to be three challenges as far as the demolition of the Supertech Twin Tower is concerned. The first challenge is going to be the demolition itself because the neighboring societies are just 9 meters away and when the demolition happens, no rubble should fall there and damage those buildings. The second will be the demolition is called a waterfall demolition which means that all the, all the floors will come down uh, crashing as the demolition takes place and the task will be to ensure that the rubble does not spread to uh, the areas that uh, also surround uh, the Supertech Twin Towers and the third is going to be the dust. Now, this is going to be a big challenge and while Noida authorities and Edifice Engineering, they are saying that there can, cannot be a concrete solution for it but some sort of labour as well as uh, sprinkling of water will be done to ensure that people who come to live after the demolition do not face the consequences of the blast because of the dust in the nearby areas. With camera person Mohammed Mursaleen and colleagues Arvind Uttam and Sarashukla Makshadungde for Indian TV.